Hello everybody, welcome back to our Demon Souls playthrough in preparation for Dark Souls. We're here still in World 1, this is part 2. We're about a third of the way through this world right now, this 1-1. -1. About to meet up with Ostrava, pick up our Thief's Ring, talk to him, he'll tell us what he wants to do, he wants us to go down there and fight. I'm going to put on my Kling Ring real quick, because a little more health never hurt anybody. I think I will solve this problem first and foremost by using Soul Arrow and taking care of them from up here. So much easier doing this. I'll drop down for that last guy right there. I think he's the only one left unless someone's behind me. And there was someone behind me, but... Luckily these guys are slow, so they are no problem. He should jump down. There he is. Give me my brass telescope. I'm just going to bank that. Don't really need it. Let's go wake up these guys camping in here. Campers. I'm going to backstab them. That's always uh, a fun thing to do. Easiest way to take care of enemies. Backstab them. And Ostrava needs to shut up because it was an accident. Even though... I usually kill him early because, you know, just get his gear. It's good magic gear, but I'm just going to let him live. He'll help me out. I will probably help him out here. Speed things along. Because this guy can be dead in two shots of my soul arrow, so... I will kill him, and then we'll go take care of these guys in here. I don't really need the gear in here or the the drops, the materials, because I'm not going to be making anything. Might just try upgrading a few pieces of equipment, you know. But nothing more than that. This is what I'm after. Souls. Gotta level up somehow, and that's souls. Nice quick attack. See, I'm going to leave this weapon on instead of my other sword I just picked up. Just for the fact that these attacks right here are so much quicker. And I am getting the shit beat out of me right there. I think it's time to bust out the magic and just kill these guys the easy way. I'm trying to conserve the magic because I don't have any spices, but... I might have to switch to other sword just for the little more attack power. And so you know what, let's just put it on right now. Nothing's gonna happen, you know. I do want some upgraded armor here, but nothing really good that I want, you know. The Dark Soul armor in that game looks sexy, I'll say that. It looks amazing, and I cannot wait to wear those armors. I want them on me. We're going to try to sneak him on this guy and give him a backstab. I don't think it'll one-shot him. Actually, I have my fucking catalyst out. I did not even realize that. Never mind. Ignore what I say, because I don't know what I'm talking about. It's a nice, easy way to take out some of these guys right here. I think that's good for now. We will say bye bye to Estrava and go take care of these guys right here. Nice and simple. Avoid the barrage of arrows coming down. Usually there's a guy right here. I don't know where he went. Um, I don't really care. If he's not there, he's not there. 
if he somehow turned invisible and is going to come from behind me invisible, well, that's going to suck. But I'm not going to worry about it. Nice invulnerability roll there. Can't be hit while you're rolling. Hopefully it's the same way in Dark Souls. Oh, there he is. I don't know where he came from. Let's take care of this other blue knight right here. Backwards roll away from that arrow. And before we go in this fog right here, I am going to go down and get some of these guys, kill these other guys down here for the souls. Or, you know what, I'm just going to pass them up actually, I don't need them. And the vendor in there, he doesn't really sell anything I need, so I'm just not going to bother with him. I'll just let them be. If I do need them, I'll come back so I can spawn them in other worlds. But for the time being, I don't need them. Dragons. And again, I'm probably not going to kill those dragons. Unless the red one severely pisses me off. You know, I'm not going to waste my time killing the dragons. I don't want to waste your time because that's going to take a while. Usually I will kill them here in World 1-2 right on the bridge, on the top of the castle actually, but that takes a while with Soul Arrow. But we are going to let them wipe out these troops right here. That guy's going to try to hide right there from the dragon. This is a nice safe spot right here. Maybe the dragon already came for him. Who knows? I'm still waiting for my dragon. That arrow went straight through my chest. Another well-placed shot by the archers in this game. Bastards. That's, uh... That's a good boy right there, that dragon. We'll let him go on one more pass, and then he will lift off, hopefully, and I can make my run across the bridge <clears throat> and avoid the... I think he saw me. Nope. Alright, so now we go and make a mad dash. We're going to juke these guys over here and roll that way. One of them should be chasing us, or possibly two should be chasing us. We'll kill them. Not going to worry about the archers. I don't really care about them. Don't care about their souls. Let's open that gate to the boss. Now we have him available. We'll let that other little zombie warrior dude chase us over here. And that dragon's just going crazy. Dropping anything, buddy? Nope. And I will stop this video right here. It's a nice little safe spot to stop. We're running short on time here. So I hope you enjoy part two. Part three will be coming up shortly with the boss fight. Please stay tuned for that. Hope you enjoyed. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.